I'm Paul Weatherall, I'm Library and Archive Services Officer for Manx National Heritage, based on the Isle of Man in Douglas in the Manx Museum. My uh, object that I've selected uh, to tell you about today, it's uh, an image from our photographic archive and it's of an internee at the gate to the internment camp that was on the island during World War I. It's called Nokelo Internment Camp and uh, during the course of World War I there were some 20, 25,000 internees uh, there on the island uh, as enemy aliens and uh, the image is of the internee at the gate to the camp. The gates are open and in the background you can see uh, the camp huts and the reason why I've chosen it is to explore the archive collections that we have about World War I internment. The image itself is from a collection of over 3,000 from a photographic studio on the island which portrays a number of internees and their lives um, in the camp during World War I. But we also have a, a large number of other records relating to World War I internment and World War II internment. The Isle of Man was used as a, a, an internee um, refuge, if you like, for both world wars. And uh, these days we've got a number of people exploring their family history and also the story of um, concentration camps, prisoner war camps and internment camps. So we have researchers from all over the world for a variety of reasons wanting to explore our archive collections relating to internment. So the, the uh, image that opens that gate is not just the gate to the camp but the gate to our archives.